Number 32. At what rate will a pendulum clock run on the moon where the acceleration due to gravity is 1.63 meters per second squared if it keeps time accurately on Earth? That is, find the time in hours it takes the clock's hour hand to make one revolution on the moon. So uh, basically this problem, 32, is going to build off of 31. So I explained uh, in detail uh, the concept here that I'm going to write out. So please check out number 31. All right, I'm going to pick up where that problem basically left off. So we found that in that problem that the uh, period of the moon relative to the period of the earth, okay, was about, um, or, or this pendulum, right, that we were talking about is, is roughly going to be 2.45, all right, uh, times the value. What that means is that essentially if I were to cross multiply these terms now that the period of uh, on the moon is going to be 2.45 times the length of the period on the earth, right? All I did was cross multiply. So basically, whatever the period on the Earth is, I can just plug that in and find the period that is going to be on the Moon. So essentially now, right, we know that the one hour hand on Earth takes about one hour, right, to uh, uh, to make a full rotation. So just plug in one and look that the period then of that same uh, pendulum is going to be 2.45 hours on the Moon. Because that was, right, I plugged an hour and this is just a simple ratio that's unit less. And there you go. All right, so again, check out number 31 for a detailed uh, discussion of how we arrived at the uh, relationship. All right, guys, thanks for tuning in. Please remember to subscribe. We'll see you next time. Take care.